What's up guys, King and the North here, back with some more of the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Today we're going to be jumping in on a hard run with Samson to try and kill Dogma and the Beast. Gonna switch things up a little bit here. We're gonna start out with the red key. Good to know. We have a room ahead of us. Alright, uh, kinda wanna be safe here. Going to try and... Get a planetarium for this run. If you're not familiar with the planetariums, Bomp has a video on the channel about the planetarium and how to get it. A uh, quick rundown. Uh, he has like a really good strategy on how to do it, but quick rundown on it. It's a new zodiac type item that gives your character some sort of a buff depending on what uh, planetarium you receive. And in order to increase your, increase your chances of getting a planetarium, you want to skip your item floors. And that probably sounds like a horrible idea. Uh, it's, it's definitely not easy, because you depend on those items usually. But um, I'm going to try that with Samson here because... <coughs> excuse me. Samson has... Well, Samson, Samson's damage goes up for every time he gets hurt. So... It's in a way I can buff myself if I, I really need to. I'm gonna use the red key here. Okay, didn't see anything in that room. A little unfortunate. Alright, now we have a uh, pride. I'm hoping my dodges have gotten a little bit better, and it shows maybe this run here. I've been doing some tainted lost runs that have been brutal to uh, get through. So, my dodges have had needed to be on point for that. I do have, by the time this is uploaded, I believe that video will be available for everyone to watch. Uh, my one Tainted Lost run, it wasn't a win, but I got pretty far in it. But I wanted to give people an idea of, at least on how I was approaching the Tainted Lost runs, and to see like what I, I look out for when I'm going, and just to see if, if maybe there's something that I wasn't really looking at. So, if we check that out, it's it's been it's been tough. Um, I've been taking pills as the tainted loss. I'm probably gonna avoid them here. I want to continue with this room. So we need to skip the item room on this floor. All you need to do is just not go in it. Check this side out. I'm guessing I have some coming from behind, yeah. Got a little bit of a damage up here. Kinda need it. This is... I mean, it's burning basement, right? Nothing over here, so it looks like we're going to have to go down. I, like I said, I am going to skip the first boss room. Oh, first, first boss room. First item room. And I believe for each consecutive one you skip, you have a 33% chance of a planetarium spawning on a floor. And then if you skip another one, which I'll probably skip the second one as well, as long as I get a decent... Alright, you know what? We're skipping. <laughs> we just got uh, <coughs> the horn, so... 
we're gonna be we're gonna be able to skip some item rooms because we're gonna have enough damage at least. Okay, take some more damage. There are some parts lying around. Right there, we got some. Perfect. Uh, where is our boss? Oh, it's gonna be over here. Okay, we're skipping skipping the item room here. Since we're doing the dogma path, we have to come back up through here, so it's not like it's lost forever. So that's also kind of why I'm willing to give this a try, just to test out what planetarium we get. I did do this on stream with one character, and I brought a present into the planetarium room, so I actually ended up getting two different planetariums. The one was... the one that I liked was Jupiter. So we're actually going to skip two item rooms, because I'm not going to go in this one. So hopefully next floor, we get a planetarium. Uh, we're going to be getting an orbital here. Not super exciting, I know. Okay, we'll grab the cube of meat. Can I access the... I can't. Alright. I think I would actually have to still take damage to go into that room anyway. Okay, so this could be a bit of a lousy fight here. Alright, not bad. Not bad. We got, and we still got a double deal, which was really good. Gonna take the HP up here. I'm hoping we get a decent item out of the double deal room. That's why I'm taking. I would be going for angel deals, but since we did get HP up here, mine as well. Go for it. We got the nail does generate hearts uh, half at a time, I believe. So, go through here. I don't recall seeing a tinted rock. There was one, I missed it. Oh well. So, 67.5% chance of a devil deal here. out for the maggots. Not maggots. Uh, I guess they're leeches. I don't know what they are. Not having flight here is uh, pretty terrible. <laughs> Got, gotta be honest. <clears throat> Lost has flight and spectral tears, so kind of rely heavily on them. <clears throat> I should probably... Pop this just to have the black heart here. I don't want to hit this chest just in case there's a troll bomb in it right now. Okay, we got a soul heart, which is pretty good. Protects our deal chances. Have the Cuban meat ready for that. We'll be coming back to this room for sure for the fires. We do have to explore the whole floor. Or the planetarium. Well, I mean, we don't have to explore the whole thing. We could technically find the planetarium, I guess. 
but we are going to have to explore everything to make sure, you know, we, we don't miss it. Chance of having it. Black Candle would be really nice. So we'll probably come back for that. Hold off on this item room for a little bit. Try to kill this poo from distance here. Okay, got a full charge on our nail. See anything here that I might want to break, so we'll hopefully get the boss room soon. I don't need the heart right this second. So if I can hold off, I want to. Looks like a battery pops up. I just want the damage up for whatever boss we're going to have. Okay. Well, this, this would have been a great room to use our nail for the damage, stompy effect for some of these rocks. Being super careful here. <laughs> I don't want to take too much damage. Uh, you know, I, I got to get in my head too that um, this isn't this isn't a lost run. So I don't have to be like insanely careful and cautious. I can I can be a little bit quicker with stuff, uh, but it's just kind of built into me right now from those tainted lost runs to be ultra careful. Okay, so we got a boss room here. Like I said, I want to use the nail in this room. There's no planetarium here, that's okay. Alright, this is not who I wanted to fight, to be honest with you. Um, not a fan of this guy at all. Blow him up with his own gas here. But he does do a lot of damage to himself. Because of the gas effect here. Alright, and then after he's through that, that phase, he's, he's not as bad here. That first phase is really the worst. He still does the gas stuff. You gotta be careful. I actually did not realize that was gonna give me damage. Oh, you know what? It's, it's like creep on the ground. That was dumb on my part. Alright, so we got a double... Yeah, what a terrible item. Chariot. Got pills here. It's the same pill. Okay, so that would be two luck downs. Alright, let's see what's in the double deal. That goat head. We need to start picking up some HP, like, stat. We'll go with it. Ah, uh, we'll take Goathead. Let's head back. Let's find the mirror. Mirror is how we are going to get an extra item from the boss. Without having to open up an item room. 
and maybe we can get a planetarium. Alright, so at least this lost has the mantle. So I can take a hit each floor or each room. Beaches. I really would have liked the tears up in that fight. Battery. All right, so this this room could suck a little bit. I do have, I gotta remember, I do have flight, so I can kind of skip across some some areas. I want to save the nail again for the boss, just for the damage up. Spectral Tears. Kinda almost got pinched there. Wanted to hold up just a little bit just to give them a little bit of time for me to work around. Oh, this guy's still walking around headless down here. Alright, half a soul heart, that's pretty a pretty nice get. I'm gonna have to be a little more careful here than I was last time. Hopefully, can get a few good shots off him and put him into phase two real fast. We have a chariot card if we need to rely on it. Do this. Got him out of phase one pretty quick. Gonna use this just to get the damage up. Not necessarily needed here, but um, you know, I do need to get the hearts going. Pageant boy, for real. All right, so really, really, really bad items for this floor. It's kind of rough passing on another item room, so this will be our third item room that we've passed on. We're doing well consumable-wise, so I'm not going to try to farm out anything. Secret room can't be there. It might be to the left here. No, it can't be. Could be here, obviously. Did we ever go into the shop? We could go into the shop. What was in there? Oh. Candle. Enough for it. Don't have to worry about any of those pesky curses. And we also got a black heart for it. Let's check for a secret room here. I got a gold heart. I didn't do this one yet right now. I'm gonna hold on to the chariot card. We will head down to the next floor. I gotta take this into the boss room. 
and drop it off. Actually, there was already a trinket in here, so it's not 100% necessary, I guess. But we need to do that so we can unlock tainted version of Samson. Head on down to the next floor. Flooded caves. Love to see it, right? At least it's not cursed. Need to try and find that planetarium. Uh, if it's not on this floor, I am going to pick up whatever the item room is. Uh, it is... Your chance of getting it is still is persistent through the rest of your run. For every... Uh, item room you missed. So we missed three. So I want to say we're probably at like roughly a, a 40 to 50% chance of finding one. I'm going to have to use a bomb here on this guy. I will come back for that head and probably use it on an area where I think a... Secret room might be, right? I might just use it in here. I want to be careful here. There's a lot of rocks and uh, holes on the ground that I could get stuck on, and Larry could actually kind of do some work on me. I'm trying to preserve as many hearts as possible. We do have a 100% chance at a double deal because of Goat's Head don't want to lose that. This curse room is currently in play for us because of the chariot card, but I, I do want to wait on that. Wow. Big get. And we got three hearts for that. Let's go. that bat. Gotta watch out for the blue ones because they have a tear shot after they die. Oh my god. Got pinched there from another shooting silkworm from the other direction. It sucks, but it happens. For the best of us. We're going to use the nail here. Break these just for the chance of a crawl space, but wanted to do it to get half of a heart. Not going to do the poo just yet. I don't think I'm going to have a reason to do the poo. Oh, we do got a planetarium. We got it. Nice. That little icon on the map that you see, it looks like a little uh, globe. Or a snow, uh, yeah, snow globe, I guess. That is the planetarium, so we're going to see what we got here. Hopefully something useful. I hope it's not one of the ones I already had on stream. I think, what did I have? Was, it was Jupiter, I forget what the other one was. Jupiter was the gas one, and it was incredibly helpful. It was, it was a great item. But the farting noises were a bit annoying to deal with. I'm going to use a bomb to get this chest. Right, there was a heart in there. Nice. Good. Okay, so let's see what we got. I'm not sure what this is. I don't know what any of them are, but, it's, you know, we're learning. Terra. Born to rock. Well, we... Oh, my God. We got rock tears. We got a 1.69 damage up. I wonder if that's permanent. Oh... Look at that. So we have like almost like, it's similar to acid tears, I guess. They are gonna check for magic mush. Why not, right? Yep. Gonna avoid the pills. Things are going well. I don't need to ruin that. Oh, they got knockback on them too. Pretty cool. So this is actually a really nice get. I don't know if it's something that's going to scale with damage that we've already received. So maybe 
Maybe everything we get from now on will have a much larger increase to it. We'll see. Got our item room here. No way. More damage. Bigger rocks. I do love 8-inch eight, eight nails, by the way. Great item. Let's check out the shop. Nothing great here. What if I hit the... Okay. If you hit the donation machine, it doesn't do anything. I wonder if you can find secret rooms with this. I'm just testing to see if it would go off or would break. I imagine this would have broken by now. I doubt they would let it be that OP. These enemies can be a little bit dangerous because of the creeper stuff they spew out. I'm stay over there, please. Okay. Not bad. Uh, very excited for this planetarium. Definitely the best one I've seen. I, uh, I have seen videos of a couple other ones. I won't, I won't talk too much about them if I want to ruin like a whole bunch of different ones. But we did get one here, which is really cool. And we got a chest room. We're definitely going in there. See what that's all about. I'm gonna pop our... Okay. I'm gonna pop the nail just for the HP. Latch key in the chest. So we got luck up here. Spend two keys, get two keys, and luck. Okay, so you can find secret rooms with the rock tiers. Okay, this. Two cherry cards? No, one's lovers. Alright. So like I said the curse room is in play for us. Because we have some form of protection. Oh my god. I can't even believe I just dodged into that. a really big floor. Eat it, pin. Eat my boulders. Oh, it's a mini champion. Careful with that. Okay. I mean, I don't need to min-max. We're we're pretty damn good. I'm not going to go all the way back to that curse. Screw that. I probably will use a chariot card, maybe, and I'll grab the rune, maybe, if I if I need it. He's got a little spewer back here, or nub, or whatever it is. We are going to get a Devil Deal here, as we know, because of Goathead. Range up. Uh, might be Krampus. It's Krampus. Um, one downside to these tiers, obviously, is uh, I have to deal with hosts in this room. Another card. Cool. Got a black heart. We are going to be taking a lump of coal. Let's 
not gonna be using the full card. We'll just take chariot and head on down. So can I blast my way? Oh, you can. How about that? It's gonna head down. Um, I need to make sure I stay on the right path here. I don't want to mess that up. All right, let's head down. Thank Depths 1. Going here. Alright, not that I need the nail here, but I'm gonna do it because full in charges. We got a strength card. Sadly, our boulders can't break uh, little spewer things. Not going to go to the middle platform here. I could have blown up a rock and made a bridge, but all right. Got a little room here. Okay. This is a file. I forget what that does. But we already have a trinket set in our item room or boss room, so we're, we're good. We'll have it. We'll have a key. This is a very aggressive sub here. Got a bomb back for our trouble. Uh, let's go in the item room. Okay, I believe this is soul. Give us two soul hearts if I'm correct. I am soul, yeah, so that's fine. I think it also has a small chance to kind of deflect enemy enemy protect projectiles. Got some coins, so our next devil deal has money equals power. Might be a good option. Get some more damage. I would like to see a little bit of speed at this point. Oh my god. Maybe maybe speed would be a bad thing. If if I'm walking into stuff like that, maybe speed isn't maybe speed isn't what we need. <laughs> No, no secret room there. We already checked that. I'm not sure why I'm why I'm checking. Okay. Area here. Right, there we go. Got through that. I was a little nervous. I was like, what am I doing wrong? Probably gonna feed Chubb here. We got seven bombs. Chubb wasn't hungry. We're going to break these, though. We're not gonna let them get out of control on us. At least this is a slower Chubb. A little bit of a heavier chub, but slower. Okay. Little... I'm asking for a little too much trouble by going over there, to be honest with you. Um, there's too many little nubs spewing tears. And I'm trying to avoid Chubb, so just take Chubb out, and then go over here and deal with the other, other issues. All right, I grab this key.
Oh, spider. <clears throat> I think that's gonna blow up on me, actually. Yeah, I gotta be careful. We'll be on depths. Dank depths one. Okay. There's two. We need to make sure we have a teleport card. Do the nail in here just because uh, we need the heart or half heart. Gotta be coming up to the boss room soon. I'm the secret room. Okay, you guys gotta settle down. in the secret room. Okay, got some money. Allergies are driving me crazy right now. My eyes are itching. Okay, it's not going to be there for super secret. I'm guessing we got to be getting close to the boss room. the secret room so not sure why I'm still checking for that long one all right check yep there it is we got a bomb beggar don't know something I really want to mess around with Do one. We'll get one payout's worth, whatever we got. Alright, yeah, I'm not gonna keep doing this. Alright, explored pretty much everything. Not gonna worry about the curse room. Gish, you boring item gifting boss. Not a fan of Gish. Uh, at all. Hopefully we get... Actually, I don't really want the Sacrificial Altar either, because I don't feel like paying for it for only one... one sacrifice. Actually, I guess it would do the Cuban meat as well, right? Wish I had a perfect. Alright, Gish... All right, so duality is kind of cool. Um, I think I'm going to take Maul of the Void, though. Yeah, I mean, Maul, Maul's really good still, even, even if it's for defensive purposes. It's still a decent, decent item. But on this floor, we're going to have to keep an eye out for our tenant skull, so we can, well, I don't know how I did that without getting hit. I was definitely scared going in there, but so we can get out of the boss room and back to the store. I will blast through all of these stones.
Ooh. All right, so we're getting kind of cornered here. Back out of that. Right, got another charge on the nail. Oof, just barely made it back to that other one. All right, um, let's get charged up. Let's get Maul charged up. All right, not gonna need it for here anyway. Ooh, it's in our item room. Uh, It's towards 2020, I guess, so. For our bookworm for 2020. Let's see what's in our chest room. Okay, Agawas, Vision. All right, let's do this. We are on the right path. We did miss our Secret room. I'm gonna do that just for the soul heart. Get ball charged up. I'm gonna use the nail in the mom fight. God. Survive that. Check out the super secret room. Might as well check it right. It's a bomb. It's okay. We leave it right behind for the next person. Alright, so we need to oh god, I'm gonna have to walk around the long way now. Um it's not safe over there either. Gotta find our tinted skull. Mall charge them just to be safe. Okay. I mean, any of these could drop a card that we could use, so I'll just pop them as we go. Oh, we can. No. Oh, wow. Super greed's here, huh? Got ourselves a quarter, so our shop would actually. Be decent, maybe. Might have something we could buy in there, especially with 83 cents. Didn't want to go there, but we will now. We might have to. We gotta find the tenant skull, so we gotta do some exploring. Oh, you know what? I think, I think this planetarium just makes any of your shots uh, similar to the acid, because I'm pretty sure the mall just. Destroyed a skull in here. All right, that goes. The sun card. Oh, brimstone spiders. One room away from the shop. No, I'm not going to use it anyway, so might as well just take care of it. I remember I was saying I was might have a decent shop. I lied. <clears throat> I'm going to give back to myself here. We are going to have an opportunity at one more shop. We'll, we'll have plenty of money for it. Chariot card. Oh, my eyes are killing me. It's itch so bad. Damn allergies. Wow, this thing broke one of the locks too. This might have been my skull here. Hermit. I mean, this works. It'll get us out of where we need to go. So let's let's take it to the boss room. We want to keep this charged up for a bomb fight.
Small Lloyd makes this fight really, really nice. Because you can kind of get Mom to hit her in a couple different areas at one time. I probably should have used the nail. Didn't do it. Doesn't matter which one we take. Get this charged up in case there's spiders or fires in here. Uh, I think I'm good. The red face causes like a fear effect on enemies near you. I think I'm good though. We're gonna piss. So we'll take the hermit card. Head on out. Go back to the starting room here. And we just have the mausoleum to go through before we start to ascend. I didn't go back and pick up a card to bring because we're going to need a cracked red key to open the door anyway. Okay, I mean, I'll take them, it's fine. Gonna hold on to the horn, of course. I'm just gonna hold this down to keep them all charging at all times. All right, let's let's try to blast this thing out of. We have enough bombs to do it. Might be a decent item. He's worth checking the chest on. Mausoleum here. Head up. I think I can avoid that heart. I don't think I can pick it up anyway. I don't have an open slot, but I just don't want it. Okay, we need to head back. No bombs? At least we didn't spend too many hearts, right? Trying to do that. Hierophant. Good card. I do want to check out. I, you know, I don't want to pass up another... We passed up enough item rooms. <laughs> Let's see what's in there. Got another shop. We can probably do something with that, maybe. We'll need to just go right for the end, right? It's all about the journey, not where you, where you go. Um, that's the other secret room. Take bombs. Bombs key. Our item room has to be up through here. Blast in the face with a boulder. These planetarian items are, are crazy. Alright, we don't have flight. We're hanging in, so we can't do anything with these chests. Okay, check out and see what we got. There's the actual planetarium item. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to take it, though. Uh, and I'm not going to take the blind item. I don't want Dr. Fetus to ruin this amazing thing we have going here. So let's head back to the boss room, pick up the note. Start going back up.
gone. Just get over it. Right, usually Mausoleum 2 going back isn't too bad. Usually not too far from the boss room. Hermit, no thanks. It would have been 10 bombs. All right, let's check it out. Grab it. I don't know. But yeah, we do get well, man, we do get to see what items we passed on. So I'll be I'll probably be making sure I check all the item rooms. Black heart going off there. Samson's lock. I thought that was the tick. I was like, oh my god, we're gonna lose the horn. what the first three item rooms we missed I think so there's there's a chance we passed over like tech something great but it'll end up probably being like piggy bank <laughs> we'll see um yeah, I mean, I'm gonna wait till I have a combat room and it's gonna make sense to use the nail. Yeah, like this room. These things have way too much health. Glad I was able to get through that. This thing's pretty cool. The lighting effect for when it goes off. I think this is a chance to get multiple planetariums, but I don't I, th I don't know if it works at this point. Temperance. Oh my god, really? I accidentally walked into that. Alright, let's uh let's use a bomb for these. to make the most of what is available to us. Uh, kind of... Glad I let him go off a little bit before I'm hurt. Gotta check the item room, because I can't remember where I left the trinket. Actually, I think I may have left it in the boss room. Boss rooms are also an option. Yeah, I don't think I left anything in an item room now that I'm Held itself through Maul the Void. Jesus. Okay, nothing. Alright. So it's, it's, I, I think I definitely left the hand, the left hand or whatever it is, in a boss room, so I shouldn't miss anything, I don't think. Yeah, there it is. Okay. There's two of them. So, it's good that I held off on using the higher fan card. Grab one crack E. We need this for the house. These guys are like, yeah, we're trying to pick that stuff up to throw it. What are you doing? Oh my god. Alright, so we didn't go in this item room. Oh, we would have been able to see through walls. I would have picked up the glasses, but, you know, Mini Mush gives us a speed up now. So 
But yeah, you get to see these second items on the way back up. Alright, we got our cracked key still. Eight floors. One, two. Three. Okay, I should be okay. This is basement, though. I'm gonna hold off on using the nail. I want to make sure I have a charge to use it on Dogma for the damage. Okay, that's one guppy piece. I, I highly doubt we are going to get the other one. It could be incredibly crazy for that many red chests to just start popping up. Ewa's passage? You know, how does this work? It doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say. I was say, we're going up, and that's gonna want to take us down. Quick kill. Fighters, gotta watch out for them, still. Probably just turn back around, to be honest with you, but... Might as well just do it and see if a soul heart drops, just to top us off. We did skip two item floor item rooms on this floor. A key beggar. Let's see what we can get out of him. There's a red chest. I believe I need to keep at least one key for the house. Well. So it took us back to... Devil Deal here. I think he was in the middle of possibly being paid out. We'll just go. We gotta hold on to the one key to see what mom item we get. Where are the item rooms? They're off to the left somewhere? I just want to see what we passed up on. Just for the... Just for the fun of it. There we go. Now, thank God we didn't get the mutated version of one of these guys. They're kind of a pain in the ass to get a lot of health. Probably would have gotten us with, in a room with this many. Isn't it? Okay. Uh, I don't know what that item is. But I don't really want to mess with it. Just to be safe. But that's what we passed up on. It was probably worth holding off on those and taking the planetarium. Because we're pretty OP. So we're going to be able to get... Wow, look at... Oh, my God, damn. oh it's because we have Mom's key. That's why the payouts are insane. Any chance of a crawl space? No. Check this room. get the uh, Tainted Samson unlock. Okay. Fear shot. Go to the tears up. And we got the Mother Transformation.
I like our chances here. I think we'll, I think we'll be all right. I hope, anyway. <laughs> Unless something happens where Dogma just completely annihilates us. I'm gonna pull back here. All right. It's kind of what I was afraid of, to be honest with you, is the static brimstones. Yep. Basically an instant hit. The way it's been acting. I had ribs. I thought I had more going is what I meant to say. It's gonna hold on to Maul for now. He passed me, so I figured I might as well go for it. He slowed, so that's what's helping us dodge the feathers right there. Skip this. I've seen it so many times at this point. So, just gonna keep going here. Oh wow, the uh, slowdown actually made that a little bit more confusing to dodge. Lost the mantle effect here. Should be okay though. This should be an interesting. Oh, uh, well, actually, this is just war. Not, oh, can I get rid of the fly before war shows up? Yeah. War's down. I was curious to see how this would go with Maul. It seems like... I don't know if it's just chance, but it seems like he really spread the scythe out a little bit further there. I'm not sure why. It's the furthest I've ever seen them like spread out like that. Now it's time for the big man. Gonna pop another nail here.
Alright, he's gonna swap sides here, I think, or he's gonna do his other rotation. Oh wow, what the hell is this? Uh, actually, the first time I've ever seen that. I've done this fight maybe like six or seven times. Falling apart on us. Since we're getting close to the end here. Yeah, that's a win. With a planetary item. Then suddenly the sky above cracked open. And a white beam of Empty Heart. Alright. Well, that's a win for Samson in the books. Got to find a planetary item here. Pretty cool. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all on the next run. Peace.